The only tow company hired by the city to remove abandoned vehicles says its drivers no longer want to tow certain vehicles. It's because of what the drivers are finding in the cars, and this could make a growing problem even worse. Bridget Namada explains. Bridget? Joe, many leave abandoned cars full of trash, or the cars were left out for so long that people toss things inside. The problem is piling up faster than tow yards can handle, and it's slowing things even more now that rubbish is in the mix. Albert's Towing is in charge of picking up abandoned cars on the island. Albert is overwhelmed. I myself sleep at least two hours every night. I mean, it's been like that for months already. Why? Because his company has to pick up abandoned cars, some full of trash. He says it's costing him thousands weekly to get rid of it all. What do I find in the cars? I find everything but money. Albert says his workers find anything from jet skis, mattresses, couches, hazardous materials, even other cars on top of abandoned vehicles. Albert says the trash has been so bad he had to rent a dumpster. Now, to put this in perspective, the dumpster is about six feet tall, seven feet wide, 20 feet long, and it only took two days to fill this up to the brim before he has to get rid of it. Dumping the trash is slowing down the pickup process, leaving abandoned cars stuck on the roadways often for weeks. He says picking up trash is not in his contract with the city. I got to bribe my workers. Hey, empty that car out. Oh, boss, we don't want to do that. There's, there, there, there's something in the car we don't want. The city doesn't blame Albert. That's not the right thing to do in this, leaving taxpayers with a big burden having to deal with these cars. The city believes the problem is getting out of hand. The problem is when they're stacked with tires or pickup trucks can be piled five high with appliances. That becomes a danger in movement. So then Albert will get back to us, and now we have to contract with a disposal company. We want people to know that there's a proper way to dispose of your bulky item, trash items, and there's a proper way to dispose of your vehicle. If you want to junk your vehicle for free, you can call the city and they'll pick it up. There are also certain times you can get your bulky item trash picked up. I'll put that information on our website.